Hello, Internet. My name is Colorful Arty, and welcome back to Harvest Moon 64, aiming towards the best ending. So, hopefully we can finish up most of the rest of Autumn today. There's not a whole lot left to do that is important. Hey, Poppery. I'm so happy. Thank you. I'm thinking about a name for my baby. Okay, cool. I guess. Doug, you've got to be liking me now, right? <laughs> yeah, I still think you're pretty cool. Thanks, Doug. Man, winning, you win one cow festival and all of a sudden he's like your best bud. It's, it's cool. And Anne's still saying the same old stuff. Man, I can't find Cliff around, which is... a little weird. <laughs> Hurry up and get back to work. <laughs> Do you interact with your child? Don't leave it all up to your wife just because you're busy. That is true. But rest assured that my baby is interacting with me just fine. Artie, you are always so energetic. I see you running all over the place. Okay, if you marry her daughter and have a kid, apparently she gets less robotic. That's good to know. It is Sunday. Mr. Mayor is at the church. Hello, Artie. How's parenthood? Babies are sweet, eh? He said something different. That's probably the only thing he'll say for the rest of the game now. Great. Oh, that's right. The florist is closed. And Ellie's here on Sundays now. Hmm, Papa? No. Father? Daddy's okay, too. Oh, interesting. Thinking of the, of the name. For me, it's really all about, like, context, so... I feel like Dad is just the normal one. Daddy is more, like, cleany, I feel. I've never really been fond of that word. And then Father is much more formal. That's just my interpretation on it. Let me know in the comments what you think of the three different dad nicknames. Dad, Daddy, and Father. Monkey. Oh, you're a feisty one. It'll be my baby's first pet. I'm getting a pet monkey. Honey, I've got a surprise! <laughs> it's a monkey. Oh, cute. But I think you should let it go. Good point. <laughs> Alright, monkey, this is where you live from now on. You can sleep in the refrigerator, and no pooping in the house. And, oh yeah, no eating the food in the fridge. That's people food. Monkey food. The monkeys have to get their own food. The game let you keep a pet monkey, but no, it's so stingy. Hey, Karen. To tell you the truth, I'm really nervous. I should take it easy. Yeah, you should. And Kai's just like, did you know this obscure fact about oh, soil? <laughs> it's pretty cool. <laughs> oh no, that's for Gots. That's for you. Are you sure? Thanks. Yes, I got scrapes for you. <laughs> What's wrong, Beardy? What's up? It'll rain all day. I feel a little depressed. <laughs> I, hope, I hope our baby likes rainy days, because I sure like rainy days. Rainy days are the best. Those On those days, it's just nice to, like, put on a nice blanket... Watch some awesome TV, maybe play some video games. Mm. Eat warm, baked goods. Oh, it's just a wonderful time. How you get golden milk from a cow, I do not understand. I don't think I want to understand. But the fact is, we get golden milk from our cow. Our cow now excretes liquid gold 
from its udders. It's probably best not to think about how that happens. Or why that happens. I believe the mayor of town is a wizard, and he puts a magic spell on your cow when it wins the cow festival that it will from then on excrete golden liquid from its udders. But it's still edible. <laughs> I should give away some of these eggs. Everyone loves eggs, especially when they're farm fresh. As opposed to, to farm not fresh, farm rotten. You don't you don't get eggs from the farm rotten farms. You're just asking for it. Before winter comes, cut down all the grass and Oh, and you don't even know. <laughs> Hey, Anne, I still am curious about that one red pixel. What is that for me? Thank you. Before, I never thought about getting married and having a baby. I'm a bit confused, but there's no time to be depressed. That's true. There's the cheerful Anne we all know. Oh, thank you. Hey, did you put your animals inside the barn? They never leave, so there's no no worries. <laughs> He's like, wait, your animals never leave the farm? Nope. <laughs> it's like they never leave the barn even, like, at all. No. <laughs> sure, it's raining a lot. This is the first day it's rained. Like, this entire season. Come on. You're a sport. Thank you. I'll take it. <laughs> Thank you, old sport. Uh-oh. He's still a go, I don't know. Well, dude, you should have thought about that before you had the kid. <laughs> hey, Ellie. Wow, that's helpful, thanks. Hee <laughs> hee, Artie, I'm pregnant. I'm so proud of myself somehow. I just want to tell everybody. I wanted to walk, slowly walk away, but I just realized there is no way to just walk slowly in this. You have to run at max speed everywhere. Fall has come. It's the season for milk tea. Okay, it's not just come, man. Like, we're deep into fall. It's closer to winter than it is to summer. I am going to get cake. Might as well get stuff on my card so I can get the honey. It's for Karen and Kai. Doggone it, I should have gotten a wild grape as well. I gots to have the wild grape. I already made that pun. I am sorry. I'm sure you guys heard that pun through the grapevine somehow. <laughs> Alright, can I be honest, everybody? When I do, like, the <laughs> laugh, is that really, really annoying? Because if so, I will stop. That's, that's just the way to denote that I just told a really bad pun. But most people don't need me to tell them that. Maybe I should get, like, a different laugh. Like, <laughs> oh, wait, that is, like, the laugh. <laughs> nope. Not doing that. Perfect. Thank you. Precious. <laughs> That guy is so angry, like, all the time. It's weird. His two sprites are angry and yawning. Oh, uh, thanks for the cake. Rain here is very different from in my hometown. Hey, Karen. <laughs> to tell... Oh, alright. I'm just befriending all of these couples. Because I feel like if you get their affection levels up even higher, then they have the baby faster. So Jack is going around befriending people just to make sure they go into premature labor, apparently. That is not cool, Jack, nor do I even know how that works. <laughs> but... Having pre premature babies, that is not good. That is very, very bad. Not that anybody does that on purpose, but... At this point, Jack is just kind of a bum. Like, 
He, he owns like, this massive farm. Pristine, like, beautiful grass fields, tons of animals, greenhouse filled with crops, and he just doesn't do anything. He's just like, crops? Who needs them? I don't need them. I've got 27, 270,000 gold. <laughs> So Jack is essentially retired at this point. This is great. Every day after I feed my cows, I can just scythe one faint of grass. Or rather, one plot of grass. And just like that, it's over. I got all the fodder I used the day back, so I will always have maxed out fodder. Smooch, 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 smooch. Smooch! Why do people watch my videos? They are terrible. <laughs> Granted, not a whole lot of people watch the Harvest Moon series because, let's face it, it was kind of exciting at the beginning, and now it's reached to the point where even I'm bored by the series, but I'm obligated just to finish it now. But, like, I'm not having a lot of fun. I gotta spruce things up. I've gotta just get on my commentary A game then and just do weird things. Because if I do weird things, the commentary kind of writes itself, and that tends to be the funniest part. But if I go out of my way to try to get interesting commentary, it tends to be not very interesting. It's a catch-22. Start the morning by watching TV. Oh, hi, wife. <laughs> Uh-oh, is her affection going down? Because she's not helping out around the farm as much. I mean, I know she's a mom now, but I mean... Game don't care about that. Game determines whether wife does work based on wife's affection level. <laughs> hey! Hi, Artie! We're holding the Egg Festival in the village tomorrow. Please join us. It's kind of like a sports meet. I was there and won last year. I will be there and win again this year. Because you actually do get a unique prize if you win year two. I said... <laughs> That's better. It's actually kind of nice that my wife's not doing work on the farm, because I like picking up my chicken's eggs. Because then I have the freedom to do with them what I please. And I like giving them out to people. They make nice gifts. Herboot! <laughs> Here you go, fish. <laughs> I gave you some chicken feed. <laughs> oh my, there we go. See, stuff like that happening. That is the funny stuff. <laughs> feed the fish, top it's a bag. I literally have been standing at this fishing spot with the bobber in the water. I should have caught that. I was literally sitting there with the bobber in the water for, like, eight in-game hours. That was ridiculous. Happy fake Easter, son! Happy fake Easter, Maria. Don't you guys know? It's fake Easter today! Also known as Easter in Fall. I don't know what they're celebrating, because this is not the day that Christ rose from the dead. But, hey! <laughs> We're celebrating fake secular Easter. Not even real Easter, fake secular Easter. <laughs> secular Easter is defined as celebrating the parts of Easter that have nothing to do with Christ at all. And don't get me wrong, I have no problem with people celebrating secular Easter, nor do I have any problem with people celebrating secular Christmas. Happy secular Easter, everybody! Secular Christ is still dead. Welcome to our annual Fall Egg Festival! Let me explain the rules! Quickly find and bring back eggs the same color as the ones I show you to win! Cool. Yeah. Hey there! Good luck! Okay, I'm ready to go, but I don't expect to win. <laughs> you better not. You know I'm gonna win. I'll do my best. My father can't come because he hurt his back. Again? Really? <laughs> I'm the substitute. I'll try hard. I'm ready. Let's do it. Hi, the mayor asked me to come. This village really likes festivals. I'm not familiar with secular pay Easter. Like I said, I'm bad at this kind of thing. Okay, I'll give it a try. 
I wonder how well it'll work this year. My egg detector. Oh, did you make improvements on it? Alrighty. Are you ready? Yes! Let Secular Easter commence! First one is this. Nothing's inside. That's it! Bingo! The next one is this. Um, what? <laughs> yes, I, I know you're the substitute. Huh, oh, five better sense. Don't talk, brother. Okay, okay. Aha, I thought I'd, it would be back there. I found the secular Easter egg. That's it, bingo! The next one is this. That one again? Oh, they do change up, that's right. That one's now white for some reason. Do -do 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 -do. Hmm, let's see, was it here? It's not in that box. I've got the stamina, but my memory is poor! Uh-oh, I can't find it. Where is it? Oh, it's right there. That's it, bingo! The next one is this. It's pink. Hey, it was there. That's it, bingo! The next one is this. Purple. Hey, what luck! <laughs> yes, that's correct! Hardy schooled you all again! <laughs> the game's over! The winner this year is Hardy! He's the secular Easter King! The prize is this mysterious turtle figurine! Okay. Thank you, please come again next year. What a confusing mess, but it was fun! It's like, I don't really understand how the eggs got switched out every time. <sighs> I'm exhausted! Oh, I feel dizzy. Oh, no. And by the way, where's our kid? Who's looking after him? Darn. I couldn't even get one. I'd try harder if the prize were money, but this is a mysterious turtle figurine. It represents the spirit of Secular Easter. On Secular Easter, everybody waits outside for Secular Christ to not rise from the dead. Around an hour, so no improvement whatsoever all over your egg detector last year, eh? That's okay, but it's back to work tomorrow. And that nets us this mysterious turtle on top of our TV. What it does it do? If you have the mysterious turtle and the invincible Katori, both at the same time, your greenhouse cannot be destroyed during typhoons. Of course, by the time you get both of them, there's like no chance of that happening because the game ends before summer really begins. But it's still cool if you really want to play past year free summer. Come on, horse. Horse! What is my horse doing? There we go. Good grief. He was not running towards me. I think he needs to run towards you for, to get the, uh, boost in affection. Come here, dog. I just realized my wife is, like, always carrying our kid around, like, pretty much everywhere. Which is good, but that also means I can't show my kid off. Which I want to do. <laughs> You're a sport. Thank you, I'll take it. I can't feel it. What? Okay. What is that for me? Thank you. Dang, still the same thing, and come on. I know this. This is probably the tenth time you've told me. When the baby's born, I'll plant a new sapling so they grow up together. That's kind of sweet, actually. Alright, and now that secular Christmas... I mean, secular Easter is over, I think that's all the time we have for this episode. Thanks for watching, I'm Color Farty. Tune in next time, we will finish up fall in the next episode. We will. I don't care how long it takes, it's gonna happen. Hope to see you there. Have a great day, and God bless.